I can click on this fax machine and it's going to send me right into all my fax machine functions. So you have an opportunity to access your fax machine simply by pointing to the fax machine that's right on the table. It's going to let me know how many faxes I have, how many have come in, when they've come in, a history of all my faxes, and yeah, we want to close that out. I just wanted to show that to you. You have an ability to print right from pointing to the printer. You have a full speakerphone that you can use in your Packard Bell Navigator. So you can talk on the phone while you're computing, you can go on the internet and call a friend with some of the information that you are interested in. In fact, this globe right here, which is glowing, do you see that on the screen where my arrow is pointing? That's your immediate access to the internet. So if you said, well, gosh, I, I'd love to be able to visit all these sites at www.whatever, you can do it with Packard Bell Navigator. It looks like a living room. It's not intimidating like other computer screens look like. When you want to work on your desk with the fax or the printer or the phone, you point right to the desk. If you want to learn a little bit more about how to use your computer, then you can go into the room in the back, which I've just highlighted, which is our info room. And here are all the tutorials, the tutorial on how to get started on your computer, how to use your mouse if you're brand new, how to use, you don't, you know, what software, what hardware, you'll learn all about it when you're in this room. L using your home electronics, because you can actually play CDs and hook up a video camera to this computer. So you can even get into video conferencing in the future if you would like to. And then all along here are all the ways for you to be able to get into the internet. We've got America Online, Disney Online, the Microsoft Network, Britannica Online, Voice View Talk Shop, TV Host, and that's going to give you an opportunity to have online television program services. And thanks to the MMX technology, you're going to get all of the information in a beautiful array. Then, right here, you can access all the software simply by going to the shelf. So, for instance, in business, there's Microsoft Word and Microsoft Works. Under edutainment, there's some stuff for the kids, the dinosaur in the garden. All these pop up right on the shelves when you click on the different cut categories. For instance, let's go into some of the entertainment. Let's take a look at Encarta. And for that, I go down to Reference and Learning, click on that, and the Encarta picture comes up. And all you do is click on that, and you're done. By the way, full speaker sound included. And while this is loading in, you'll see how quickly this loads in. Using something like the Navigator, it's going to let you expand in the future. And having the MMX technology, which we're all hearing about on television, gives you the ability to have those high-tech graphics that nearly what looks like regular television right on your screen. Now, if you're using this for an office, What's great is you've got Microsoft Word, so you can click right into Microsoft Word for Windows 95, because Windows 95 is also included in here. And you computers, can... I never had an opportunity to see them look like television. And it's really through the new Pentium chip and the ability of the MMX now technology to turn your computer into what's looking like full motion video. It's amazing. Now, this media select panel, which is right down here, is exclusive to Packard Bell. And that means that you can check your messages, you can check your faxes, you can ch uh, talk on the phone, listen to the CD, have direct access to the internet, and then if you have an external tuner or television uh, cable set up, you can watch television, you can listen to the radio, you can do all of this and adjust the volume right here on Media Select. So one button push without even bothering to go in with your mouse puts you directly where you need to go. That's what's really neat about the Media Select panel. Now, where do you see this full motion video? Because this blew me away the first time I saw it. And this is just a fun way to look at music videos right on your own screen. And remember, the monitor is off to the maximum speed CD-ROM, and it's giving you that MMX technology. Now you know when you get that software, when your kids come home with a CD-ROM that they can't wait to play, or when you are doing some functions at work and you want to come home and work on your computer, you will be able to. And, you know, what happens when you're going out on the Internet, I must be honest with you, I really did not surf the net quite often until a couple weeks ago. And the first night my husband and I, through America Online, went right on the Internet, because we don't have the ease of a Packard Bell, and we're not able to go ahead and, you know, go right through Navigator like I showed you a moment ago. But we were working with that, and I was just amazed at the wealth of information. Being new parents, we visited websites, and we visited all sorts of different things that had to do with children. And then he loved cars, so we were going out with cars. And 
um, I was talking to my niece about a part of the world that we'd love to visit sometime, and the next time I came over, she had this beautifully typed out report. I think that's what really made me so impressed about computing, was when I saw what the eight and nine-year-olds are turning in as their papers these days. When you remember what we did when we were kids in like, you know, sixth, seventh, eighth grade, the stuff that the first graders are tuning in because they're, they have the computers and they have the opportunity to do this. Okay. Alrighty. Oh, oh I'm getting there. I'm playing with this this morning because you can make a label for everything. You can label all your folders. You can label all your drawers. You can label all your canisters in the kitchen. You can label your husband. You start labeling and there's no stopping with E15824. Now this comes with tape, so you're able to print out professional looking labels that you can put on folders. If you're keeping all of your tax records right now, you might want to date them and you might want to put professional looking um, labels on that as well. What this comes with is the printer itself, the label maker itself, uses eight AA batteries which are not included. And you're also going to get the little tape so this is a tape stamp that's going. And you're also going to be able to get a label maker as well. So you get the stamp, or the stamp maker, I should say. So this is going to let you make your own stamps. You also get the tape that you need. And then you're going to get this labeler. And I mean, there are so many options for this. For instance, let's just say, let me turn this on. And I can't type backwards, so I apologize. I'm going to have to do that this way. OK. And let's just say your daughter's going off to school and you want to send her there with you know everything labeled you want to do a little um first aid kit perhaps so you might put band-aids okay and just hit print after you type it in just hit print and this is how quickly it's going to happen so out comes a little able and by the way you can decide how large you want the letters you can decide the font of the letter and very quickly We'll show you. We just printed out band-aids. So if you're going to do a first aid kit, even for your car, yeah, I'll do it again, but I just want to show you what I did in a second. Uh, let's see, what else would you have in a first aid kit? You might do um, aspirin. Okay, so there's band-aids. That's my first label I did. You wanted to put aspirin, so you would just, um, let me see. Backspace, backspace, backspace. Dee -dee -dee -dee. And you can delete it very easily as well. We might do aspirin and hit print so you type right here what you just typed comes up in the window and then it prints it out this little blue dot right here is actually a lever that cuts your label so now we've got aspirin so we could take these labels and you peel them off let me see if my fingernails can get in there and once you peel these off they've got a sticky side so then they'll affix to oh paper you can put them on bottles if you're doing your first aid kit like i'm doing right here of course, I can't see because I need glasses, so because it's always nerve-wracking when you've got a camera in your face. Okay, there we go. So let me just use my blue card that says QVC on it. Now we've got our list. Now let's say we're doing taxes. So we want to make sure, let me bring this back in and delete that out. Okay, let's say we're doing our taxes. So we want charitable or space gift. Okay, hit print. So now you can have a folder with all your charitable gifts. And you can do that year by year by year. If you're going to be doing, um, let's say in your bedroom, you want to be really organized and you want to organize your jewelry. You know, I sometimes have little jewelry boxes, but I'm not sure what's on the inside. Well, there's charitable gifts that you can do for your taxes. If you want to backspace this in, okay, and delete that, maybe you put silver space earring and you've got little boxes print you can label all your jewelry that's in your jewelry box and for your kids at school they're going to love it because they probably oh i spelled silver wrong oh well we can go back and do that again as you can see it prints right away so you don't have to worry about that if your kids are going to school and they're going to do homework homework let me take you back they can do math space homework Kids are going to take this over, by the way. And then they can have a little folder with math homework. I can take typing. I'm not that bad. See, why didn't you take typing? 
It's a very valuable asset to, to do typing. And you should have taken it at Cardinal O'Hara. I don't know what you were doing. Okay. Let's see. I have I, I, the beginning of this. I forgot to do that. Okay. Well, then you can just cut that. And see? Math homework. That can do, you can do for your kids. Maybe um, it's like dad's stuff. Maybe he wants to make sure that nobody else. Okay. Whoops. Okay. Let me delete all this stuff. Okay, let me see. What should I put? Let's put, okay, let's put Laurie and Faith and put Virginia, because that's who's on the phone. Hi, Laurie, how are you? Fine, thank you. Welcome to QVC. Thank you. What are you going to do with your label maker? Well, I'm going to label my spices, mm -hmm. my files, and certain other things. And do it in a really professional way. Plus, you can decide the font, and you can decide the size that you're using right. with this. And once you get this open, which is only taking me a little bit of time, because, as I said, it's very nerve-wracking to have this camera right in your face. <laughs> but when you get these guys at home, and you get this um, label ready to peel, just get that one corner out, and then right. you'll, you'll go. Then this stays put when you put it right on the card or whatever you're doing. Can you tell me, can you, uh, uh, how do you get the tape? Uh, you purchase it at a store? You can get the tape Standard. from the store. You are going to get tape along with it. Uh -huh. So you'll be able to make a bunch of labels. But this is from Casio, so you'll be able to get the tapes and, uh, oh, fine. Yeah, just fine. about anywhere. Uh -huh. And it works with two different um, styles. Uh -huh. I'm actually using the 9 millimeter tape, right. which makes it this wide. Uh -huh. But if you want to make really big labels, you're also going to get that 18 millimeter tape as well. So that makes oh, that's it twice as big. Oh, that's nice. So you'll be able to see it a little bit easier. Right. Great. And well, then well, how, does, how does the date work? You had, I didn't hear you talk about the date. Pardon me? Something about the date. What did I say about the date? The time, a date stamp. Oh, you have an opportunity to make your own stamp with this. Oh, I see. That you can use as well. I'm sorry. I, I'm oh, not sure. Okay. I was... I was <laughs> losing it there for a second. I thought, now, I know it doesn't do the date automatically, so I'm not sure what you're talking about. Right. But yeah, here you have an opportunity with this to make a little stamp maker that you can customize and you can personalize any way you want. Oh, that's fine. Terrific, terrific. Would you like to play Tic Tac Q? Okay. Okay. You, do you really want to? Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> you sound like, well, I don't know. I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. No. I'm always cutting recipes out of the newspaper and out of magazines, and I was tired of them constantly getting wet and ruined, so I bought a laminator. Well, it was not a whole lot less than this from QVC, and it's about this big. So I'm only able to laminate things for maybe four or five inches. Well, we've got a brand new laminator on QVC today. It has never been on the air before, and already over half our quantity is gone. E15541 is a laminator that gives you, in the personal laminator by seal, a much larger area. So now you can even laminate things, well, like the kids' artwork that we have behind us. But before we do that, I want to introduce you to our guest. His name is Harvey Diamond. Harvey, come on out. Yes. Welcome to QVC. Thank you. Great nice to have you here. You, I'll let you, let which side you. you need to be this on. You fine. zip fine. over there. Yeah. Before we get started with the actual demonstrations, Harvey, you've come up with some great things that you've laminated, and this is the one I wanted everybody to see, because as we all know, if we have children, kids love to make us birthday mm -hmm. cards, and every time you see them, they're drawing a new picture. Now you can laminate this forever. As you can see, there's a little bit of shine there. That's because this is yeah. never going to go away. There's my recipes that I talked about. These you get different so kind many of things great recipes. Do. And look at this. I've got a lot of recipes like this. My mom passed away many years ago, but I've got some recipes in her handwriting, and I certainly want to save them for my daughter. You can laminate them as well. Every, anything that's on paper, you can laminate. And I know before we get started, you've got a very special one in your family that you wanted to show to everybody, which shows how yes. older photos can sometimes right. fade, can't they? Well, old photos, especially the old black and whites, which we all have, they're maybe 20, 30, 40 years old. Mm -hmm. they, they dry out, uh, they get cracked, things like that. What we did with this composite is we took a old photo and put it on one now, side. That? Tell That's us my father and myself when I was born in oh, 1937. No, we can't oh, pardon see me, 1937. That was that 60 years old almost that photo. God bless you. On the other side, we took a picture of my father with my granddaughter, which was born in 1987. Aww. So we have the father of the granddaughter and the father of the grandfather <laughs> on the same front to back and wow. that's the kind of things you can do 